I've jumped as much as 160, 170 feet and uh, the truck actually lands pretty well. But when you start to start jumping that high, wind starts getting up under the hood, you'll notice the truck will want to start creeping up. If it creeps up too far, you got to hit the brakes and it'll plane the truck out. So it's, it's a real, it's a crazy balance. when the RC guys jump them they actually use the brake and the accelerator yep. to, 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 to change the flight of the pickup or you know the RC car can you do the same thing I can but you know remember this is a 4,000 pound truck and once it gets committed and it's up so high and you nail the brakes you got to catch it before it gets too high if you let the truck start to stand up you're not gonna bring it back down with the brakes so what's it like to fly like that is it spooky you know you're hitting these jumps at what 75 80 miles an hour it doesn't seem it to me when I'm out in the truck, but like if I'm sitting on the sideline watching practice and watching other trucks out there, I'm kind of like, holy smokes, you know, we do that. I mean, the, the thought of getting hurt, it's always in your, always in your brain, but uh, you know, I'm a pretty fierce competitor and I'll pretty much do whatever it takes to try to win. Yeah, I was just saying that because, you know, obviously this weekend uh, we had the death of an IndyCar driver, which is very tragic. And so as a race car driver, does that does that something that you think of? Yeah, it, it, it's always in your head. You know, you come, you know, come time to race, you try to block it out. Uh, had a, you know, a good friend of mine die this last week in a plane crash that we short course race with. Uh, Rick Hughesman, he's pretty much one of the best in the business. So we're certainly not invincible, but we do what we can to protect ourselves and, uh, just go out and run hard, but be safe. Tell me, what's your favorite part of racing? I think it's just the, the competitiveness of it. You know, if you know your truck is equal than every other guy's and we're, you know, we're entering the track equal, the only thing that's gonna make you win over him is the decisions that I make in the truck and I really like that.